The Grimsby Public Library's author series brings to town some of Canada's most renowned authors. The 17th season continues October 22nd at the Casablanca Winery Inn. When we were building this new library, we were looking as a board, and I was the chairman of the board at the time, we were looking for a way of making some kind of contribution to the new library. And we thought some way help out with a little bit of money, perhaps for some special funding or whatever. And one of the guys on the board came up with the idea of uh, maybe we should do try an author series. And we all thought that was a great idea, just that we had no idea how to do that. And um, we thought you just write to an author and they automatically write back and say, yes, I'm coming. And uh, Jane Urquhart dissuaded us of that whole image because she said no to us. She was the first person we asked. And then we thought, okay, this is going to be a little harder than we thought. But over the years, we've learned, and we, and it's all been by um, trial and error, moving forward, starting small, and growing to where we are now to sell out audiences of 250 people. Unlike most reading events, Grimsby's series brings together two authors for each night. We started out with one author, and then there was such an appetite for hearing authors read their work. And we, we kept getting such positive feedback from people that we thought, uh, I thought that it would be a good idea, let's try two authors. And um, we did that. So in about our third season, we started to, um, we moved to the idea of two authors and we've never looked back from that time. It's, it's, been, it's been a great success that way. This year's schedule for the author series looks a bit different than it did in previous years. It's a little bit different in that we're, um, we're going to do, we've sold tickets for the first three uh, evenings this fall, September, October, November. And then we're going to take a little bit of a break for January, February and early March. And we're trying it out because we're just finding that more and more weather is an issue in the winter time for those winter months. People go away on holidays and they're missing and they don't want to miss programming. And uh, there's the whole issue of illness. We had an author last year, had to cancel because of flu. And we were thinking that because of um, that, those, those issues that we have to deal with in those early winter months, that perhaps what we do is take a little bit of a hiatus and then pick it up again at the end of March and go March, April, May. The Giller Prize nominated Eden Robinson is booked for the October event. Eden Robinson is one of the um, top female indigenous writers in the country today. She's a wonderful writer. The Trickster's uh, Drift is the second in the three-part trilogy that she is writing. It's a coming-of-age story about a 16-year-old lad, Jared Martin, and um, uh, she has a wonderful ray. She's very contemporary, ray, very grounded in the contemporary, yet she blends it with native narrative. So you get this blend of native narrative plus the, um, uh, some of the dysfunction and the violence of some small towns in British Columbia in the current setting. And it's a, it's a book that's, that's laced with humor, but also with a lot, of, a lot of serious message. Appearing with Robinson is Montreal author Joanna Goodman. The Home for Unwanted Girls is, is a book that deals with uh, a young woman in Quebec in the 1950s who was forced to give up her child. It also deals with some of the ethnic issues, um, the Maurice Duplessis government and the rules and the laws that dealt with young women who went into homes for, with pregnancies. And the book is about the search and about the lives of the young woman who was forced to give up her baby and uh, searching for her mother. And it's a very powerful book, very provocative book. And again, one of these stories that, has, that is inspired by the author's own family. For information and tickets on the author series, visit the library's website at grimsby.polarislibrary.ca. Reporting for The Source, I'm Mike Balsam.